there's no patrol here. There, it was why they take a while notice to, you know, have police sitting out there sometime. Terry Woodard says more police in the area might have prevented a major heist that took place at the Nike store on Victory Ridge Cove in Raleigh. Thursday morning, Nike workers were gathering smashed cardboard boxes, a mess left behind after thieves stole $200,000 in merchandise from a freight truck behind the Nike store in the Nike distribution facility. It happened around 4 a.m. with a security guard telling Memphis police, quote, I had just taken my lunch break and I happened to have my windows down. I heard a loud boom and turned from inside my car to see a guy open the door to the trailer. I watched them and I called my supervisor." End quote. Responding police spotted five vehicles fleeing the scene, four sedans and a pickup truck heading south on New Allen. Police found a back gate to the Nike store open, the chain cut, the doors to a freight truck opened, and boxes thrown around the parking lot. It's Nike's second major merchandise theft in a month. Two suspects were charged with stealing $400,000 worth of Nike shoes from a boxcar in North Memphis in early August. Woodard and his son, who works at Amazon, differ on why thieves are bolder than ever. They're desperate. No, they're not desperate. They're sorry and lazy, no good. Exactly. Tyranny Johnson was shocked to hear about the theft at the Nike store. She says more security isn't necessarily the answer. It's just the community it just has to come together and just watch out and speak up when stuff like this happens. In Raleigh, Mike Suriani, WREG News Channel 3.